can see one of the entrances of the, the town here, which is still the same town of Marsh. Um, two obelisks, and the obelisk is a symbol of the pharaonic domination. And um, here we see the European witch who has an alliance with Pharaoh, with the aristocracy, due to the Jus uh, Prime Noctis. So you see, you know, she's holding, she's holding, um, and there are 12 spears here. Here there are two, here there are 10, and she's having one in her hand. And the 13th part, actually, as the obelisk, um, the part, uh, that's the, the part of Osiris they could never find again, which was his phallus. So this is also one of the ways the, uh, the witches dominate over man, see? But what I really wanted to show you, well, here we can see the, um, uh, the basic apaches here, the oval, it's everywhere. Uh, oh nice, it's green for a change, eh? And this is what I wanted to show you. Mm, that too. Yeah, look. We all see the square, like the square and compass. It's always on a roundabout. And this one here, it's going down. So that means they're building from the top down, downwards. You know, on top is like the devil, Pharaoh, and then they build down. And what are they building? They're building a triangle. You see? It's a triangle they're building, like this. So that stands for the number three. Because there are three corners in it. And it is the compass, as I showed you, which is 60 degrees. With 60 degrees, you can build um, a triangle, which is the side of a pyramid. And that means it's the uh, hierarchy. It's them, you know. And the base is the square. You know, that's us. And it would stand for the number four, the four corners in it. So three plus four all together, you know, it makes seven, like the G here, which is the seventh letter of the alphabet. And these guys know it perfectly well. And this is not very far away from the castle of the guy who built a, uh, this, the, uh, this, the, um, Solde Refuge, the uh, hideout for the Templars at exactly 4,003 meters where they brought the children in that castle, remember? So, that means, you know, it's not finished yet. Because they still want to show the square, which is us, the base of a pyramid, the people, the slaves, and the three, you know, the hierarchy, the pyramid, well, that's them. And um, our, our masters. So, it's not finished yet. It means we are in the New World Order, you know, in America since 1776. Switzerland was the first in 1291. But they haven't finished their total control work yet. It will be finished when they're going to give us the mark of the beast, the 666, the RFID, in our foreheads and our, uh, in our hands. And this line, they're going to finish it, probably with another color. Then their work is finished. Then we're gone. The roundabout. It's a very... And there's another bloke. I don't know what, what that is. That's man. European man. There. Yeah, slave. European woman. You know, a witch. There's an alliance. You know, they send the man into war. And them, our masters. And everybody is going around here. You know, everybody sees it. A very highly Freemason town here. I've rarely seen that. I've never seen this. Look, it's horrible. It's really, it's, it's horrible. Our masters. Oh, sorry for the noise. There's that thing again. You know, our masters. Look, three. Again, three. The sisters of Isis. Our daughters, maybe. Huh. There's the woman. The uh, European witch holding our dicks. Because it's the 13th. Um, the 13th um, thing there, the flash, or the nail. Ah, oh, they are nails, actually. It means they nailed us. And look, here's the man. He's got a rope around his neck while they're holding his dick. Uh, they all know, this is the real story of Adam and Eve. You know, there's Adam, it's Adam and Steve nowadays. Look, there's Eve. 
only his dick. And he's got a rope around his neck. Now, I have to pay, you know, for the alimony, or pay this, pay that. You know, rope around his neck. Go into the war, die. The G, our leaders, that's much higher. It's silver, you know. Uh, <laughs> And um, Sisters of Isis, the Alliance. So here's also the number three. And I think, yes, there are. There are the two other blokes there, so that's four. And with these two here. Four heads. All these all this weird things here, man. Um, creepy. Yeah. They, they, they tell it all through the symbols. Just as they did with the hieroglyphs, you know, they tell the whole story with symbols. That's what they do. And I tell you again, they are not finished yet. We are in the New World Order since a long time now, but they haven't finished the total control yet. So you've got a little bit of time left, but it's not very much. It is not very much. Do something. So, and he, you know, he's holding it. A cup of beer in his hands, you know, to um, to drug the people. Just drink beer after work. Four, they're f you know, they're actually they're four. It's because it's the base, just like the four here. That's us, the square. And uh, this guy is uh, he's making clothes apparently. So as Adam and Eve, you know, she's holding his dick. You know, uh, uh, proverb, proverbially speaking. That's, that's, what it, that's what's happening, right? And then, you know, a rope for in his daily life, a rope around his neck. In the evening, a, um, well, she's holding it. And um, then have a beer afterwards and go to sleep, you know, or have the beer before, or even in the morning, you know. Uh, four. So the four, the people, the three witches there, it's all here. Dominantly four and three. So it also means, you know, that the uh, the rule, the the pyramid, them, um, they they build it downwards. You know, it means like you, if you make a construction, you build it upwards from down. And because this is an idea, a rule or a reign, they build it downwards. But it's also, of course, it's also a, a physical pyramid. You can, you know, with square and compass. But it's they they emphasize it on it that they're building down, you know, uh, an, an idea which you build from the top, the hierarchy, them Pharaoh down. And on the contrary, a uh, physical building you build it from down upwards. So it's really the idea, you know, behind it here. Uh, they're just emphasizing it, uh, that the, uh, it says, you know, the rule, the rule, the reign, our masters, it's from up, going downwards, that's what it means, that's why they put it there, and not below. And two obelisks at the other entrance of the town, and mush. M for Mason with an oval in it, you know, expensive hotel. They know where to go with obelisk next to it. So still in that same town, Marsh. I already filmed this one for you a couple of years back on my other channel. You see the rings here, you know, getting together like Audi, Mastercard, Gucci, the basic capaches, and they form an oval in the middle. Okay. But you see here in the same town. You see that same pyramid like in the other thing there before, it's it's like on its side. So you don't, it's in the same town, you know, and they are, what are they? They are, um, oh, like this, they are architects, see, architects. So you think they're not related? They got these three things in the middle, always three, for Horus, Isis and Seth. And here they finish the job, you know, it's a, it's a complete pyramid. Um, these one probably made these things, all Freemason stuff. But at least they know each other, you know. Why, in that same time, they put it up like this here. And the other one, remember, it was finished from the top. It wasn't finished yet. So they worked their way down from the top. They are the hierarchy, they are the masters. And all ideas are being worked down from the top.
is where there is a uh, construction, a building, it's, it's worked up from bottom down. So, as it says, Carmel, the mountain in Israel. Probably pharaonic as well, at least it's got a pyramid on it. So there you come, not driving with your car, you're not suspecting uh, anything. So what you, you think, you see a cube. That's in 3D, but that's not what you see. You see a hexachrome. And uh, why is that important? It's also the, uh, the, uh, the seal of Solomon, and like many people attach that to Zionism, and but that's not really the case. You know, you can, you can see the square and compass in, in here. Because in a hexagram, you can stuff the, the square and compass in it. You see? And then you get a six-pointed star all together. So, the same as in the other town. So, this is the town of Wee. Y-U-H-U-Y. Um, and... Um, even here you see the square, you know, they, they put it in blue, it's, it's all over, these guys. Uh, Templars V and a square. And a little pier, a little triangle there as well. Yeah. We're done, eh? We're done. Everywhere. They con they're absolutely in control of everything. We're done. It's, it's, it's all over the place. You know, that too, you know, you see the uh, basic capaitas. Like four ovals, or at least part of it, it's everywhere. Hey, you see the logo of this company, it's a cube. You can put a square and compass in it to get a hexagonal, as, as you can see there, forget about the 3D. And the whole thing looks like a G. Because uh, the G is the seventh letter in the alphabet. And that's, here it says in the cube, the square and compass, the square stands for four. Compass stands for three. That's why they even put the G in it. Yeah. It's all here, you know? It's all here. Everything belongs to them. Well, the logo of the company with the G, Freemason G, this number seven it is. It's even encircled with two times a, uh, a Templar's V in it. Why would they do this, you know? It's, it's always the same. And the, this Templar V always also looks like a, uh, a square, which is a bit like uh, hungover. You know? Why would they do this? Well, well it's, it's an, ar an architect. Well, he knows what he's doing. You know? He doesn't need to see the pharaoh, shall I? You know, no wonder that the European headquarters of the European community is in Brussels. You know, another quiet country about, about whom never we never talk about it in the media the laws of silence just switzerland but switzerland is the very very base and um, it's, um they're very good slaves here there are a couple of nice people but the rest are very very good slaves uh, yeah you're the land of the brussels the european community well that's not a coincidence Especially if you see all this here. Yeah? They never talk about it ex except when there's like Dutroux. They stop talking about that as well. <laughs>